Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Hannah and on this channel we talk all things home decor, home aesthetics, mixing high and low with new and old. And in today's video we are doing home goods best of for the month of August. So if this is something you are interested in watching, just keep on. If you are just clicking on this video, welcome. I head to home goods every single month to showcase the best products that I can find. Home decor, textiles, furniture, you name it, I compile it into one video every single month. Now there are two things that I'm going to state with every single item within today's video. One is the price and two is the style number. Now that style number is important because that is the information you need in order to see if your local home goods has that item in stock. So just jot down the number and then give your local home goods a phone call. Another tip for you guys is just let them know what type of item it is so they can better categorize what department it's going to be in. I have to say that August is a little bit different than most of the months that I have been recording because we are starting to transition into that fall time so there's not that much home decor like they're not super heavily stocked on home decor items like they usually are i still was able to find a bunch of really beautiful items but they're starting to bring in more of that seasonal stuff our halloween decor our fall decor and i've even started to see a little bit of christmas so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video but without further ado let's get into it Want the mood to be right, keeping it low in the night, yeah. So long since I get a glimpse of a light, it's blurring out my eyes. Oh, oh, we should open up our window. Oh, oh, I can't see clear. Oh, oh, I know how to window, to window, cause it's just my heart. I'm sure most of you guys are over the links for home decor, but I thought these were really different. They almost look like rope or almost braided. I just thought these were definitely something we would see on like McGee and Co. Really fun and a little bit different than what we were used to seeing. If you need a friend, yeah, yeah Fake one Staying until the end Yeah, I know how to play pretend Oh, oh, tell me how do I get inside Oh, oh, open up your mind Oh, oh, in this I know how to win a fight This Burlwood console was absolutely stunning Priced at $800 This thing was massive in length And it just had these really fun and chunky legs it definitely reminded me something like from our house. And as I was shopping in this particular home goods, I did come across a matching coffee table, which you guys will see here. Again, the size of these were really big and this one was priced at $1,000. So if this is something you needed for a really big space, if you are looking for a really big coffee table, these were two very stunning pieces here at home goods. This particular home goods had a handful of these really fun gray barrel chairs. I thought these would make a really great addition to a dining table. Maybe you have a formal dining table. Having all of these would be so cute. The color was very neutral and they were only priced at $200 a piece. These next few items I was absolutely thrilled to find. These are wooden vessels that are very, very popular right now. They are on Etsy for about $100, but here at Home Goods they were only priced at $50. Sometimes you will find them that are like look-alikes, but these legit looked very vintage to me, including this olive jug as well. We find these on Etsy as well, upwards of $300, but these ones were only priced at $30 a piece. So if you love that vintage look, if you've been wanting one of these, these are a really great price for the same exact thing. Now 
Now, I came across this item on tjmax.com. Obviously, as you guys know, Home Goods and TJ Maxx are sister stores, so it was really fun to actually see this item in person. Only priced at $20, but if you were loving that travertine style and that trend, these are a really beautiful option. Now this next item that I came across, I'm not quite sure if this is supposed to be a magazine or a book holder or if it's just supposed to be a decorative item, but I did throw a book in there and it worked perfectly. So if you do come across this, this was only priced at 25 bucks and would make a really great book holder. The moment I came across this terracotta jack o' lantern at Home Goods, it reminded me of the ones from Pottery Barn that ranged from $50 to about $90 a piece. Here at Home Goods, the small one was $25, and then I found another one with no jack o' lantern face, just plain for $30. So if you love that really fun terracotta Pottery Barn style, these were really great in their fall department. This next console table, I just loved the contrast. It had a really beautiful marble top, nothing with too much veining, very simple. And then it had this really fun, natural reading leg. This is definitely something that we would see on Kathy Co for upwards of $800. Here at Home Goods, it's only priced at 300, so you're definitely achieving that designer look for less. This next lamp reminded me of the newest table lamp from a game code called the Montage Lamp, which is priced at $400. This lamp here at Home Goods definitely has the bones if you want to maybe make it have that rustic appearance. Starting with a black base and maybe working it up to have that rustic feel would be super simple to do, and it was only priced at 50 bucks. These next two nesting tables, I found a dupe on Wayfair for $1,300 called the McCoy nesting tables. They were almost identical to the ones here at Home Goods, but I really love these paired together. Maybe pair them by a accent chair or on the side of a sofa, and I think they will just add an extra layer to any space. All right, guys, and that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the month of August. Be sure to turn into next month where I will showcase September. We will probably be showcasing a little bit more of that fall decor. I wanted to bring it to you guys a little bit, but I will definitely be showcasing a lot more of that holiday inspired items in next month's video. But until next time, I love you guys so much. Thank you for being here, and we'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.